There's nothing more important than making sure your messages stay secure, no matter what platform you're using. WhatsApp prides themselves on security and encryption, making sure users verify their accounts and enable two-factor authentication. That doesn't mean everything is perfect, of course. If you use a weak password or you forget to enable two-factor on your device, you risk losing access to your account. If you're worried about someone else using your WhatsApp account, we've got you covered. The good news is that, for the most part, it's easy to find out if someone is using your account. The app alerts you when someone has signed into your account on the web client, for example, displaying a notification that makes it easy to track your security status online. You can also look for some telltale signs of a disturbance in your account, including messages you didn't send. Ask your friends if they've received odd spam in their messages from your WhatsApp account, often including ads or phishing links that corrupt their accounts as well. For the most part, as long as you have your phone with you, you should be able to avoid hackers using your account outside of WhatsApp web. You can shut down any WhatsApp web session using your phone by tapping on the triple dotted menu icon in the top right corner of the screen, selecting WhatsApp web from the list, then tapping on log out from all devices. If your camera activates in order to scan a new QR code, you're safe and secure from hackers. Of course, you should follow some essential steps to keep your account secure. Change your password to a unique code and, of course, use a password manager if you can. Also, you'll need to enable two-factor verification in WhatsApp if you haven't already. With two-factor authentication, anyone who tries to log into your account will need to enter a PIN. To enable it, tap the triple dotted menu button in the top right corner of the screen, then select Settings and Account. Now, select Two-Step Verification, Tap the Enable button and set your PIN code. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering WhatsApp and other technology. And do not forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.